Your hardware is tripping the circuit breaker. We need a new one. Hi TFTS. Obligatory long time lurker. First time poster. ETC etc. First some background. I currently work as a biomedical field engineer, which means I install OEM medical equipment in hospitals, clinics, medical environments. I also perform repairs in the field and test, to make sure everything is okay, according to OEM and medical standards. I'm technical support, not clinical. We have other employees for those questions, usually brand reps with a clinical background. Anyway, onto the story. First the characters. Dollar sign ME, Raptor Boy, me, by armed. Dollar sign REP, OEM brand rep, very friendly guy, we get on well. Dollar sign BME, by a medical engineer at customer site. Dollar sign BME underscore BOSS, dollar sign BME apostrophe S manager, a senior biomedical engineer. I've met him multiple times, and he seems like a nice guy. The story. I get an ML from dollar sign REP. Dollar sign REP, hey, Raptor boy, customer has an issue with the device, by armed says it is tripping the RCDs on site. Dollar sign ME, HMM, okay, have they tried to plug the device into another circuit to confirm, that the device is actually tripping the RCDs, and isn't just RCD. Now, and RCD is a current monitoring device, that constantly monitors the electric current flowing through one or more circuits it is used to protect. If it detects electricity flowing down an unintended path, such as through a person, who has touched a live part, the RCD will switch the circuit off very quickly, significantly reducing the risk of death or serious injury. Dollar sign REP, okay I'll let the buy arms on site know and see what happens. I go back to my work and a few hours later, get a call from dollar sign REP. Dollar sign REP, hey, the customer wants you to attend the site, and fix the unit. Dollar sign ME, have they tried plugging the device into another circuit? Dollar sign REP, the by arm that reported the fault says, that we should attend the site, and perform a field repair, as the unit is under a service contract. Dollar sign ME, okay, but that customer is only on an annual preventative maintenance, PM, contract, two site visits a year, they get software upgrades, and PM parts only, but a field repair will cost them money, it's also a 4 hour drive, which is also chargeable, are you sure, that they haven't just tried another circuit to confirm the fault? I performed preventative maintenance on the unit only last month, and it was perfectly fine. Dollar sign REP, yes they know, but you're technical right. Did you want to call them? You can talk on their level. Here is dollar sign BMES number. Dollar sign ME, okay, no worries. I call dollar sign BME. Dollar sign ME, hi, this is Raptor Boy from OEM. I hear you're having trouble with one of our devices? Dollar sign BME, yeah, it's tripping our RCDs, can you come out and fix it? Dollar sign ME, sure, but I just want to confirm, that our device is actually faulty. Have you tried plugging it into another circuit? Or maybe the circuit it is on has too much stuff on it? Dollar sign BME, I'm busy, can't you just come out and fix it? Dollar sign ME, your site is on a preventative maintenance contract, all field repairs are chargeable. I just want to confirm, that our device is faulty, before we charge you. Dollar sign BME, look, I know what I'm doing. I've worked with stuff way more advanced than your devices. Your stuff is under a contract, and it's faulty, now come out and fix it. I have more important equipment, to deal with so just do your job. Dollar sign BME then hung up. He also sent an impolite ML to dollar sign REP, that the local field engineer was belittling him, and trying to get out of work. He also got the theater manager, as well as my boss. I get a call from dollar sign REP shortly after. Dollar sign REP, what happened? Our boss is asking, why we have a customer complaining about you. Dollar sign ME, I literally called to confirm the fault, and dollar sign BME wasn't helpful at all. I couldn't even confirm, if he'd tried plugging the device into another circuit. Dollar sign REP, okay, let me see what the boss wants to do. He's on the phone with the customer now. Now you're definitely sure the unit was okay, when you performed preventative maintenance last month. 
Dollar sign Emmy. Yes, I'm sure. You know I'm Farah. Dollar sign REP then hangs up to talk to our boss, explain everything and asks what he'd like us to do. Dollar sign REP. Well, the boss has given the okay to go to site. He talked with the theater manager, and this BME has kinda thrown you under the bus. Boss said if our unit is faulty, the field repair will be free like under a comprehensive contract. If there is no fault, charge them for a field repair, but be thorough. The customer says they will have the unit in the biomedical engineering workshop. Next day I drive the 4 hours to site, and head to the biomedical engineering workshop. I find the unit, and see dollar sign BME underscore BOSS nearby, he's the only one here. Dollar sign ME, hey dollar sign BME underscore BOSS. Dollar sign BME underscore BOSS, hey, Raptor boy, I just heard about this thing. Dollar sign BME was going on about it this morning over the phone, and something about you not wanting to come fix it? That can't be right. Also, weren't you just here last month for the 6 monthly service on this thing? Dollar sign ME. Dollar sign BME said it was tripping the RCDs, but didn't confirm if he'd tried multiple RCDs. Also, yeah I was here last month, no problems with this device. Dollar sign BME underscore BOSS. What? Well, dollar sign BME is on his day off today, okay. Since it's tripping our CDs, run an electrical safety test to make sure it's electrically safe. I set up my test gear and test the device. Result is good. Unit is electrically safe and shouldn't trip any RCDs. Dollar sign BME underscore BOSS. Okay. Let's just plug it in here and see what happens. We plug the device in. Power it on. Unit boots just fine. No RCDs are tripped. No problems. Try another two circuits, no problem. We then take the unit to theaters, where the unit usually is, when it isn't being used. Plug it in. Power it on. Unit boots okay, no tripped RCDs. Try another circuit, no problems. We then take the unit into the operating theater, where the unit is used in a surgical procedure. Plug it in. Power it on. Unit boots okay, no tripped RCDs. Try another two circuits, no problems. Dollar sign BME underscore BOSS, HMM okay, run your tests, and let's see if it trips anything through normal use. I set up my gear, run all my tests and all good, no worries. Dollar sign BME underscore BOSS, so the unit is okay. Dollar sign ME, yeah, nothing wrong. Can't fault the device. Dollar sign BME underscore BOSS, HMM okay, this visit is chargeable isn't it? Dollar sign ME, yes, your theater manager wanted us to come out as soon as possible. Dollar sign BME underscore BOSS, ugh, what a waste of time. If someone told me about this, I would have confirmed the fault myself. Anyway, let's head back to the workshop and I can sign off on your paperwork. It's been a bit slow this week, so I'll even shout you a coffee. As we are heading back, we run into the theater manager. He tell us an RCD is tripping in another theater, where they're setting up for a procedure.